<sighs> Alright everybody. What is going on? It looks like I'm at a photo shoot. <laughs> it looks like I've got a black background for a photo shoot. See? Now I haven't been outside yet. The quicker you here, the faster you go. That's why where I come from, the only thing we know is oh. Where are we? It's uh it's like nine o'clock in the morning. I got to sleep at about two o'clock our time. So that's um 12.30 p.m. No, sorry, 4.30 p.m. Sorry, 3.30 p.m. Australian time. It was 2 o'clock uh, two o'clock Indonesian time. So the time now is 9 o'clock Indonesian time and uh, I'm about to go and drink my first coffee of the day and I can't wait. So last night I decided to put the camera away. I, I tried to vlog throughout the, the plane journey, but to be honest, I was I was pretty keen just to get here. And so, I don't know, I honestly didn't have much to say. I tried to talk to the camera, it didn't come out very well, so I decided just to cut it. So today is our first day in Bali. I'm gonna head outside, see where Anna is. I feel like she's, she put something on Facebook like two hours ago, I don't know where she is. She usually gets up pretty early, goes for walks, breakfast, all that kind of shit. Hopefully she's still here, because I'm hungry and thirsty for coffee. So I'll see you soon. Let's go check it out. It's going to be interesting actually, I'll grab my phone and we'll head outside see where she is. Shut that. So anyway, if you were wondering, this is my bedroom. It's pretty small, there's three bedrooms in this villa. Um, we only need two, obviously. Man, I'm stoked, eh? I mean, I was expecting it to be a shit night, I was expecting it, I was, I was going to roll around, I was going to be you know, excited for today, I wouldn't be able to sleep, I'd feel like shit, because that's what usually happens man, usually, usually, when I come to Bali, I'm drinking on the way. So I get here, I'm pretty tipsy, I might have a few more, I go to bed, I, yeah I pass out and I sleep, but I wake up with a hangover on the first day. Last night, didn't happen, I feel fucking great. Now let's go and find Anna. Yep, it's getting foggy again. Hey. Sup? Have you been up? Mm -hmm. Where? There's coffee in there. Oh, sweet. Your room's a mess already. You've only been here eight hours. Yo, I was <laughs> up to unpacking and then, like, got tired again. Good sleep? Mine was. Yeah, I didn't. I was wide awake at six. Nah, it's too early for me. I know. Anyway, I'm gonna go get coffee then. Goodbye. Goodbye. And that's ours, by the way. Just for us. I don't know what's going on there. Let's go and check out the lounge. I mean, look at like the only thing, guys. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to. Uh, Wipe the lens here. The only thing about Bali Villa accommodation, man, I can't, I can't fault this. It's huge. Look at it: kitchen, dining, lounge. That's the other bedroom, the third bedroom, TV. The only thing, guys, is this is most likely going to be your only form of air conditioning, and that's because they don't want you to leave on split systems that waste electricity. They're pretty stingy with the electricity, so if you want to spend time in this area here, you're either going to have to go for a swim every half an hour because it gets fucking hot, or, you know, go out, do things, spend time inside, but it's not all about that, because, you I mean, Bali, Bali's just the same as Darwin, it's humid, but you just get used to it, so, you know, these, these camera lenses won't do this forever, like, honestly, even the camera lens will get used to it, so, uh, what's, what's this over here? The locals trying to market their stuff. What does it say? If you want to see, try, or buy some jewellery, please ask the manager or the maid to unlock the display. Ganga Gemstones is a small family business from Bali. Thank you for your support. You know what? You know what? If I do find something here that I like, I might actually buy it. Look at those lock look at those lockets. They look pretty sick. 
Anyways, where's the coffee? Plunger coffee as well. Is that hot? Yes it is. Cup, cup, cup. Any sugar? Come on, mate. It's gotta be. What's this? On it. <laughs> Thought it might be. It's salt. What's this? No. Definitely not that. Oh well. Straight black coffee it is. I've done it before. I'll do it again. Now you guys. You guys that are with me, man, you guys that drink coffee, you'll know. You'll know exactly how I'm feeling right now. Prior to the first sip of the day. Okay? We all know how good that first sip is. Especially when you're on holiday. Could be hotter, but it's good. I'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, everybody. How's the beard looking? It's getting a little out of hand. What is up? We're back. It's day number two. Yesterday, well, not much happened, to be honest. But we did start drinking at about 5 p.m. It's, uh, what time is it? It's like 7.30, 7.21, Sunday the 4th of November. And here we are. Welcome to the villa, welcome back. I don't know about you. And I don't know about my sister, but right now, I need some coffee. And then we're gonna do some more editing. So I'm gonna try try and work this out. We've got where is the where is the coffee? She's stolen it. Don't tell me you've used it all, Anna. Don't you tell me. <laughs> no. No! This is disastrous. Let me see here. Nope. Alright guys, so we were um we were using the coffee last night to make these espresso martinis with Kahlua and vodka. And it seems it seems as if Anna's used all the coffee which I am not fucking happy about. So you know what? I'm gonna turn the vlog off here. And uh, I'm gonna jump on my scooter, head down to the shop, get some coffee, and come back. I'll show you my scooter out here. Oh shit! What the f Oh my god. I almost stepped on that thing. Look at it. Don't you dare jump at me, mate. What do you make of that? I'm not sure. Yeah, it's I locked it, just as I should have. Okay, well, nothing's easy this morning it seems, so uh, I'll see you guys in a little while. I'm gonna go and get a coffee, sit down, set my computer up again, send some messages back and some emails, do some editing, wait for my sister to, to wake up, and uh, who cares, we're on holiday, man. You can do anything. All right, everyone, <clears throat> I have returned. Uh, with with coffee, four different types, believe it or not, because there's no way I'm coming back here with the wrong sort. You never know what they're giving you, honestly. <laughs> Communication barrier. Um, everything's in Indonesian on the front of the packets. You just don't know what you're getting. So I do know one thing: this one will be a winner. Nescafe, ice cold mocha in a can. In fact, you know what? Let's do this. See, I don't like that. With my coffee, I like black coffee. I don't like milky coffees. So, what I've tried to do is um, I've chosen three different sachets. They all look like they've got black coffee in them, but I guarantee not all of them do. I made a bit of a loss. I don't know how I'm going to heat up water. They don't have a jug. Uh, 
Oh well. First one. Yeah. It's got to be black coffee, right? If it's not, we both lose. Oh no, actually, I think I think they put sugar in there. They do have hot water, by the way. everybody what is going on morning three of the trip to Bali yesterday I didn't pick up the camera I haven't been taking the camera out of the villa because it's too big the camera's huge I mean look at it it's like two kilos it's a fucking monster it's a Canon 80D if anyone had wondered what, what camera I use so anyways yesterday we went for a mission we had some breakfast um, we went to get coffee of course I think I had a few drinks uh, but, you know, I was in bed by 10, you know, because, fuck, the heat, the heat, the humidity, combined with drinking, if you don't drink enough water, it's like, you're not going to last. So, today is our final full day here in Kuta, or South Kuta. Tomorrow morning at 11 o'clock, we get picked up from here, we go down to the wharf, to the port, get on a boat, and head over to an island. I think it's Limbongan Island. Limbongan Island? I think so. Um, I haven't ever been to an island off of Bali. So Bali is, you know, if you were wondering, Bali's an island, one of the islands that makes up Indonesia. So Indonesia is the country, Indonesia has their flag, it's uh, red and white, and Bali is one of the islands. It's a big tourist destination, it's a huge tourist destination for Australians and New Zealanders, especially because it's so close and it's so cheap. So, um, you know, We'll go to any restaurant and you'll be able to get food, a good meal for definitely under $10, if not like six or five. They can be slightly small, um, but if you're paying five bucks a meal, what's the, what's the problem? So, uh, you know, we've eaten well, we've drunk well. We probably did about six or seven Ks walking yesterday. So um, as far as my physique goes, because that's another thing on holiday, man, you know. You don't want to let go of all of the work that you've done in the gym if you're trying to diet, if you're trying to get lean for the holiday, if you're trying to put on muscle like I've been trying to do. I don't want to let that go. So if I don't go to the gym at all over these next few days, or this, you know, this entire holiday, you know, the least I can do is keep my diet in check so I don't go back fatter than I did. If anything, yeah, I'll lose a little bit of muscle, a little bit of fullness, but I'll stay just as lean. Anyways, I haven't gone out of this room yet. Um, it's about time I get my first coffee of the day because that's always a great time and uh, I'm gonna open these curtains for the first time and go and find my sister. So let's do that. Oh. There she is. Hello. Good morning. How long have you been up for? Since 6.30. Because I... It's 8.30. I knew we needed coffee. You got some, did you? I got some proper stuff like instant coffee and it was 50 cents for 10 servings we've got instant coffee mm -hmm. i was well, actually thinking walked, we could we could I, we could order some espressos and then put some ice in there i was gonna there. say if i'd walked like two minutes further i would have gone to the um whoops uh, espresso cafe which i think would serve our iced espressos now, well we'll i think it's in the school and all the kids go to school at 7 a.m how crazy what is day that? is it monday, monday. Hmm. That is crazy. 7 a.m. Yeah. It's because they can get off at lunchtime and go work for their family. And they're all in beautiful little uniforms. Yeah, they're all been in the pool, mate? Yeah. You yeah. need a shower when you've got a pool. Yeah, exactly. And it's much cooler because of the rain. Yeah, what about the freaking weather, man? Just when you went to bed, it just started pouring yeah. down. Yeah, I think it's going to do that every night. It stays on the weather thing. Storms Must be the night. tropical. And then, like Tropical. at nine o'clock, you see the lightning start. It's kind of like Alice Springs, you know. You see the lightning and the thunder first, and then it just pisses down with rain. Yeah, well, I was seeing lightning out there, but I couldn't hear any thunder. It must have been ages away, and then it got closer. Yeah. And then the down. But no, there's freaking animal sounds and shit. 
keep me up. I think it's the frogs. Possibly. Well, I'm a walker. They're loud. Like, but you know that frog there? Well, there was yeah. one about ten times the size, like that big, fat as fuck, and someone had run over it, and it literally all its guts oh. were just out its mouth. Fuck that, man. <laughs> I know. I thought a frog that was three centimetres wide was scary enough. No, 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 no. I wouldn't be going anywhere near that shit. It's like a bullfrog. Cane toad. And then it's going to get you. dogs that kind of like, if you walk past, they come up to your legs. We're in the real what pops. Yeah, we are. Yeah. But we've still got villa life right in the middle of it, so. This is villa life. That's what it is. Mm -hmm. Pool, lounges, nice bedrooms, a big open space, lounge area, although, you need air conditioning, man. These do nothing. Absolutely nothing. So anyways, what was I saying? Oh yeah, coffee. Back to the old Nest Cafe. Let's do it. Okay, we've got something. This is the best version of an iced Americano or an iced, iced long black that I can make. Not bad. Um, so I'm going to get in the pool, just as Anna did, and um, get back to some Instagram messages. Because the reality is, is that I get hundreds. And one of the things from the very start that I've always wanted to do, early on in the YouTube channel, I made sure to do this, is to get back to every single person that commented. Obviously, once the YouTube channel started getting more successful, that was impossible, so I moved over to Instagram. Every single message I've ever received on Instagram for one of you guys, I've replied to. And if I have, down in the comment section below, let them know. Because that is, that's a bit of a grind sometimes, but I do enjoy it. So right now, and I especially enjoy it in the morning with a coffee, and that's exactly what I'm going to do. So if you've sent me a message over the last few days, I'm going to get back to you right now, and uh, let's talk. <laughs> 